All right, everybody. So this is my Phyllis Hyman look. Um, so stay tuned for the rest of the video if you want to see how I got this look. This is like her from the 80s or whatever, but yeah, this is it. Hey everybody, so I'm gonna get started on my Phyllis Hyman tutorial. Um, I have a picture that I looked at um, to give me some ideas. Her eyebrows are a little bit thinner than mine. I'm gonna see if I can try to pull it up on my iPad and look back and forth between that, but let's get started. So first I'm gonna start with these eyebrows. Um, her eyebrows kind of went up and then they got a thinned out like towards here. So I'm gonna outline them first and then I'm gonna use the concealer to kind of sculpt them out a little bit more. Um, like they were back in the pictures I saw. So I'll let you see the picture. Hold this on. This is my reference picture, and I'm gonna be looking at it back and forth. So it looks like she has a pretty much straight thing here until it gets shorter right there. Um, and she has a very, like a gold here, and then like a hooded eye right there with some very strong under eye, a nice glossy lip, and some contour and blush like a mug. So let's get started. You said it right then. So she had this cut crease thing going where it was kind of like a brown and then like a gold and then like a little brown in the corner. I'm going to use my Nubian 2 palette by Juvia's Place and we're going to use the colors of, looks like, yeah, my ya is gone though, <laughs> it broke. But we're going to use Kenya probably and maybe Nairobi. So let's see. Without your baby And my life's better because of you I never thought Alright, so up next, um, so my eyes are done Nice and dramatic in 80s And so now I'm going to use my Photo Loving Primer Then I'm going to use my Black Opal um, Stick in Beautiful Bronze It's my summer color And uh, we'll go from there So now I'm going to use my Pro Conceal um, Concealer by LA Girls and Toffee to uh, give me some dimension. Yep, so I saw that she had some really strong contrast, so I'm going to try to work on that. Uh, making sure I don't mess up my eye, because I should have done my eyes after I did my concealer, but I think it'll turn out just fine. That contrast was something powerful. So I'm gonna do uh, my contours right here. I'm gonna make it real 80s because that's the way that contour was back then. Mm-hmm. Put it right in between where my highlights are gonna sit and just blend that bad boy in. I'm using uh, my True Contour palette by Black Radiance. So now in the picture, okay, she had some contours right here and some contours right here. And yeah, so we're gonna do that. I think my eyes are a little too purple, but I think it'll be fine once I photograph. So now for this mega blush. This blush and contour is serious. So it looks like she got this coral joint happening, so I'm gonna do this. And it looks like it kind of goes like that. Yep, like this. I'm gonna blend it some more, but it looks like it goes all the way up in here. Well, I need to blend that some more. So last but not least, she has on this kind of um, spicy, corally lip. So I'm gonna do that, and then I'm gonna put on this wig, so. So now I gotta put on, so this is what it looks like, see? Now I gotta put on my earrings and then my little white little something. I'll figure it out. Yep. Okay, so I got that look down. So now let me just get this white thing happening. But yeah, she has her eyes kind of covered like that, like. All right, so this is the uh, final look. Let me see if I can take a picture or whatever. 